Hey guys, welcome back to Far Cry 6. We just had a little heart to heart with um, Bicho. But now, Talia may. Well, I, I just got through talking with Clara, and she was telling me that maybe Maximus Matanus is maybe too far gone, that they don't want a, they don't want a revolution. But maybe I can convince them. We hit Maria's rum factory, we fucked up her billboards, and the bitch didn't even bat a fake eyelash. Meanwhile, Maximus Matanzas is dead, and I'm still stuck in this swamp. We've spilled real blood, Danny, and Marquesa doesn't even have a scratch on her. Fuck this. I'm gonna call out her bullshit right to her face. Marquesa's putting on a PR event, some kind of tour for foreign journalists. If you can get us passes, I'll give her a one-on-one -on -one performance in front of the whole world. Force them to hear the truth. I'll do that. Let's fuck up Marquesa's show. Indeed. All right, where's Marquesa's show? Where is Marquesa's show? It's not too far. Let's see. Ooh, it is right in a uh, Maria Marquesa's Productions. All right, let's go there. Oh, we made it. We made it to the production site. Ooh, this place is crawling with enemies. Should disable the alarm. Yep. Sniper? Wait, no, that's... Clara, I need press passes. I'm coming up to Maria's TV station. Anything you can tell me? Press passes? I won't ask. Look, Danny, they're holding one of our guerrillas inside. So free them if you can. I'll do my best. I'll do what I can. Yes, Clara. Over here. Better watch myself. As I just start killing people with no plan. Haha! Good come in handy. Got a key. Got your press passes. Let's do this shit. Hola, reporter Benavides. Danny, got a shit hot song for that bitch, so don't fuck this up. This Italia, keep it together, okay? You keep it together, Danny. Meet me and Bicho in the Botanical Gardens parking lot, and don't go in without us. Okay, I'll try not to. First, I want to liberate this station. Fuck. Shut up. Where'd you go? I see one. I see one. Where'd you go, buddy boy? Fuck the truck. Fuck your truck, bitch. Well, thank you. I don't really want them here. Fuck, that's not that's not a thing. Where are they at? Uh, Fuck. Hit 
these fuckers. Where are these people? I saw you. I saw you. there. Where's the thing? Where's the chopper? Alright, we're gonna have to do it the other way. Go up the goddamn ladder, idiot. Okay, fine. Yeah. All right, fine. We've liberated this uh, TV station. We've got the press passes. Is Libertad Station, baby! Maria Marquesas Russians, Libertad Control. Okay, guys. We've taken over the, the production. Let's see what we can find. Okay, I've got the press passes. Just gotta wait for. Um, what's her face? Talia and Bicho. Come on, guys. Here, your reporter now. Felicidades. Fuck yeah. This is Talia Benavides from Urban Garden. Coño, it's good enough. Take our stuff so we don't get shot. Let's change these clothes. You're a big boy now, Bicho. You got a gun. Wait, aren't you? Silvia Balboa, Garden City. Urban Garden. Can we move this along? Maria's waiting. Welcome. Welcome, my beautiful foreign friends. Uh-oh, we gotta blend in. Gracias for traveling so far to learn about the Viro. Oh, I like that. Listen to Maria's pro propaganda bullshit. Let us begin. The architecture. Impressive. Fine. A lot of money not going to the rest of the R.I. Today, I am honored and excited to share with you the miracle of Viviro, a revolutionary cancer treatment. Thirteen years yeah, ago, yeah, yeah, a brilliant yeah, yeah. biochemist, blah, Dr. Blah. Edgar Reyes, to the discovered a compound unique to Where's Yama that, Talia? that slows oh, there cancer she is. cell growth. But it is Presidente Anton Castillo's full support that allows us to produce this unnatural drug. Come, witness a breakthrough of innovation, generosity, and true yarn spirit. Follow me. But not too close, right? Don't want to be suspicious. Possible for the inside tour. You really make a reporter feel special. Anything for you, Nikolai. <laughs> what about me? I'm cool. It all starts with Nicotiana Yarana, our native tobacco plant grown in our western farmlands. Our tobacco is world famous for its unique flavor. Wondering what made it so unique, Dr. Reyes studied the plant's properties. And I don't mean he smoked a lot of cigars. <laughs> <laughs> he found a compound that actually slows cancer cell division practically to a halt. Practically is the qualifying this word. Way, my lovely people. That was supposed to cure cancer. I guess. You got snacks in this place? Dr. Reyes 
found that natural tobacco crops produced a limited amount of the compound. So, President Anton commissioned Yara's best minds to work with Dr. Reyes to design an all-natural fertilizer, PG-240. Spread on, like a hairspray, it uses gene therapy and nutrients to boost production of the compound. If you look, this tobacco has a large red... I am bored already. Beautiful, no? Can I kill you now? No? Would anyone like to spray the plants? Come, press this button. Press the button. So much fun. I got it. Can I... <laughs> Can I can I press the button? Oh, okay, me. I'll press. Okay, me. Smells like perfume. Then, the fertilizer is working on the plant at the This is the beginning of the Viviro process. Using McKay to sidestep embargoes was considered quite controversial. Who oh, is that lady? Only want to profit from cancer. From death. They see us as a threat, so they try to ruin us. This way, por favor. I'll go. I'll go down. Don't want to get too close. Don't want to be suspicious. Okay, closer. Closer. Get intimate. <laughs> I want you to hear me. I will. You and me, babe. Can I touch? In Central Yara, our finest scientists extract refine and package the cancer-fighting tobacco compound called Yarantin. Found only in Yaran tobacco, Dr. Reyes thinks Yarantin is why our cigars are so smooth. <laughs> Delicious and beneficial, no? So you can I smoke... smoke cigar a week and it keeps me skinny and strong. So you it's can true. smoke the uh, Vivido? Okay, that's the tour. Our interactive stations are now available for you to enjoy. Okay, when cool. you are ready, join me by the gate in the outdoor lounge for a surprise guest. Who is it, Anto Castillo? All right, I'll there play. There are rumors that farmers exposed to PG240 are actually developing cancer. Rumors spread by I could totally break her fucking neck right now. Uh -huh. right. I could totally break her fucking neck right now. Essential to killing Yarans. You're really a scientist? <laughs> of course. I'm developing new methods of delivery for Vivido. We're working on a nasal spray, transdermal patches, and chewables for children. I love my work. I'm helping heal the world. I'm gonna kill your fucking boss, lady. Okay, I'm done. Where is the lady? Where's the nice lady at? Oh, I stuck to the guard. Stay with a group, por favor. I'm trying. Okay, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Take the medicine. Let's take the medicine right under their nose. We got a maintenance key. No one suspects a thing. I'm just taking things. And this ends our tour. But before we go, a surprise. Meet Dr. Edgar Reyes, the pioneer behind Viviro. Dr. Reyes, thank you so much for making an appearance. Ah, muy bien. Okay, everyone. Enjoy the showroom and some of our finest Yara and Roma. This is a preview of other Viviro products we are developing. Chewables, nasal sprays, vaginal suppositories. Vaginal suppositories? Is, uh, By the way, your rum, I got a bad so I got a bad news about that. So peek, peek away. <laughs> if you have questions, please email my assistant, Julio. Alright, cool. Thanks for the tour, lady. Come now, Dr. Reyes. We don't want to be late. Neither do we. Let's get in there. I told Vicho to leave our weapons back here. I hope you're ready to fuck shit up. I'm ready to fuck shit up, babe. Fuck all the shit up. Ooh. So what now? Take it as it comes. We got this. Stay on your toes. I'm gonna try. I'm gonna try. I promise I'm gonna try. Try and be a good boy. Try and be a good soldier. Connection frozen. 
Ooh, there's a there's a big cloud. Oh my god. There's people dining right now. Hold on, no, 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 no. We're gonna go back to my shoddy. Put us real fuck shit up. Someone go deal with the terrorists. Go tell ya. Oh, oh, oh. Stop it! Get that one! Oh, fuck. Come on, come on, come on! Die? You don't need shit. Not yet, not yet, not yet. I thought everyone's fucking dead. Die. Are the terrorists dead? What is going on? Don't worry about it. Coming for you, babe. Coming for you. I want an update now. When he's giving an interview to Dr. Reyes, tell he has some words for her. Okay, where's she at? Okay, she's over there. Sorry, I'm coming. Don't start the party without me. Yes, 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 come on. Get on with it. Oh, don't, don't shoot. I'm just a scientist. They just leave. Where was it? Fucking kill her, kill her right now. True Yarens, welcome. We have a special program for you today. Maria Puta Marquesa, Puta. Minister of Culture, Uncle Anton's personal whore. You're also director to the True Yaren Academy, no? Where you fry people's brains to make sure they play nice? Like you did to me, right, Maria? What? Mm, don't play dumb, bitch! Daria, put the gun down. She's not worth it. You... You attacked my home. You put your filth on my network. You have any idea the embarrassment I had to endure because of your disgusting performance? I don't give a shit about that. I have given everything I am to be here. You think you can take that away from me? My academy was built to save fake yarns like you and that muddy macho you spread your perversions with. Ooh. And Don't talk about she? him like that. Does she not approve of you playing with guns? Oh, fuck that bitch up. Fuck. Okay, let's go, let's go. Bicho, you're late. Get her the fuck out of here! Oh, we're fucking dead. Ooh, and Hotel Paraíso, Esperanza. Another Anton, um, lovely clip. Hello? can't play buddy
Was that really Diego's mom? I wonder what, how Anton thinks about it now. I wonder if he's like, oh, thank God that fucking bitch is dead. Sorry, Diego. Oh, you're gonna drink one too. That's right! She was his mom. Wonder why she she disowned him. Like she like she didn't acknowledge him. But way to way to break the news, Anton. Words like bullets. Ooh, the prisons has been increased. So, so what happens now? Hello? What happens now? Hola. Hola. Let's, hold on, let's see what we got. I think that's it. Hold on, you know what? Let's do a Yaren story. We got time for one thing. So let's talk to... Hmm. Man's best enemy. Let's do some... Let's do something for Juan. Yeah. Let's do something for Juan, a military target. Did Maximus Matanzas, are they part, are, are, are they, have they joined the Libertad? No. I don't know what to do. Hold on. All right, let's do this one. Boomer bust. We'll do this one, then we'll, then we'll, uh, oh, yeah. then we'll leave. Head the Ferrosa. You're not having a heart attack. Uh, how, how do you know? We need Paolo. Paolo knows how to fix this. Paolo's in Miami by now. No, no, no. He's still here. Danny, come find me in the little mountain just west of the airport. There's a bunker, and I'll be the Mexican on top of it. Okay, okay. Just take a breath. I'm on my way. Ooh, lost and found. Okay, we're not going to do that one just yet. We're going to do the... Uh... Clara, Maria Marquesa is dead. Yeah, it's on the news everywhere. What happened? It wasn't the plan. Fuck, I don't think there ever was a plan. Look, you and Dali are at the top of Anton's shit list. Watch your back. A lot of people are counting on you, Danny. We got a chance here. Word is Castillo has a defection problem. Who knows? He might even surrender. You're dreaming, Clara. Fuck yeah, I am. Yeah, fucking Anton ain't gonna fucking surrender. He ain't gonna do it. Hold on, let's just do this one thing with uh, Juan, and then uh, it'll end the episode. You good? Okay, what do we gotta do? Weapons are in high, in a light blue McKay shipping container. We gotta search the town to find the right one. Okay, so like one of these. Okay then. None of that. Might be in this. Oh, hold on, hold on. Could be useful. Could be useful, but nothing useful. There's one over here. Why does everyone have to be locked? Ooh. All right, let's deal with this guy. Die, bitch! Yeah, I just saved your ass from a fucking mountain lion, asshole. 
gonna be the last one, isn't it? What the hell happened to you? Okay, oh, here's one right here. Hold on, there's a message. Okay. A dog? To whichever Russian reads us, you don't you won't ever get a deal like this again, straight from the hills of backwoods Americana. Getting real guns used used to liberate or terrorize real people. The cult stopped paying. The, the, the cult stopped paying, so now your little yarn crime family has the black market opportunity of a lifetime. Yes, maybe we didn't necessarily secure the shipping container perfectly, but who would have, who would actively sneak into Yada right now? Even I read the news. I've heard about those outcast camps. Just in case. How did you get puppy. in here, boy? Hi, puppy. Juan, I just found a weapons shipment. American. Interested? Danny, that's like asking Saddam if he wanted more chemical weapons during the Anfal campaign. Of course I'm fucking interested. Found a dog, too. Dogs are useful in war. Long history there. Sergeant Stobby, Chips, Nemo. Does it have a name? No, not yet. What the fuck, Danny? It has no identity? Give it a name! Okay, okay. Um, how about... Boom Boom? Perfect. Perfect. Train him to go straight for the cojones. I like my dogs like I like my wars. Violent, unpredictable, and with a lot of humping. Something tells me Boom Boom's got some fight in him already. Cool. Did I get Boom Boom? Did I get Boom Boom as a, as a little amigo? Did I? Please tell me. I did! He's an amigo! Cool. Alright, what's this? Moises. Don't be freaked out, but some crazy American paid us to ship the dog. Said he was get he was getting even with the monkey god by giving us better a better life. This hurt guy has clearly never been to Yara. I don't care how cold the winters are in Montana. This pooch is gonna have to f have to fight to survive on the island. That thing got all paid out in gold bars, though. So I took a little extra cash and left some of the fancy rich person dog food in the shipping container. The good boy deserves a good meal. All right, cool. Cool. Got a little amigo. We got a perro. Puppy. Hi, puppy. Anyway, that's where we're going to end it today. Fucking Maria Marquesa is dead. We found out that she is actually Diego's mom. But still, I don't get why she didn't, uh, why she doesn't acknowledge him. Why she, wh when she was asked about being Diego's mom, why she said no. I don't get it. But, you know, things are going down, things are getting crazy. Fucking Talia went all haywire and fucking killed her. Anyway, um, if you liked the video, give it a thumbs up. Don't forget to hit subscribe if you haven't. Thank you so much for watching and I'll see you guys next time.